Hello, everyone. Welcome to Celebrate Black Excellence. I'm your digital host, Carlton T. Clay. This segment is sponsored by the Great Augusta Black Chamber of Commerce. And our next guest is the executive director of the Black Farm Street Incorporated, LaShondra Robinson. How are you doing today, LaShondra? I'm doing great. Thank you. Thank you for being here. We appreciate you for taking time out of your business schedule to talk with us today. I appreciate it. Thank you for having me. No problem. Now, you're originally from Florida. I am. So what brought you here to Augusta? So, well, actually, I came here from Texas. Okay. I am originally from Florida. I moved here from Texas pursuing purpose. I heard a call from God saying I was moving to Augusta, Georgia. And I was like, what? I don't know anybody <laughs> in Augusta, Georgia, but here I am. Awesome. And um, what is your, you're a military veteran as well. I am. So thank you for your service. Thank you. Um, you're also dabbling, you're a chef and all that great stuff. Can you just talk about your background, how you got into farming? So once I did move here and in the middle of my stillness, um, God told me I was going to be farming. So I had to let go of my chef hat and I had to go out and learn how to farm. Mm -hmm. And so I went to different farms um, and I learned good with hands on technically. And so... They just taught me how to farm at the different farms, and this this is where I am now. And you do produce, not livestock. That is correct. Okay, can you, for people who may not know, okay. can you explain the difference? So with produce, that's all vegetables and fruits, versus livestock is all animals. So I only grow things that we can eat, such as um, melons, tomatoes, eggplants, peppers, you name it, in the produce section, we'll grow it. Awesome. And again, you are the executive director of the Black Farm Street Incorporated. Can you first talk about how that got started? So Black Farm Street was started um, when I did start at Farmer. I was looking for a name that would represent our organization. And um, I was inspired by Black Wall Street. And the thing about that would inspire me the most was they was all about living um, as a cohesive unit but it would impact the economics of everyone involved. And it did not only impact black people, but it impacted the whole community in, in, in a collective way. Mm -hmm. And so in farming, it's not just a race or ethnicity. Um, it's also about um, getting food to those who need it the most. It's about becoming one with the earth. Um, and so since it's so, um, wide of who those who that touches i thought that black pharmacy would be a good name for the organization how important is farming to the local economy um i think it's very important um without it we wouldn't survive i mean we can also survive on water but we do need food and to get food your food comes from a farm from somewhere around the world whether that's livestock or fresh produce um if somebody wants to be a part of black farm street how can they be a part of it? So you one, you can go to our website, which is blackformstreet.org. You can subscribe to our newsletters, or you can just go on there to see what we have going on. Or you can reach me at allthingslashandra.com and send me a message so that we can connect and we can see how you would like to be a part of the organization. And you are a member of the Black Chamber of Commerce. So how have they helped you as far as your business and your organization? Well, the chamber, they have given me a fresh perspective on um, collective efforts. Um, we are better together. And so they do have a wonderful mentorship program that can help me um, grow, not only as a founder or executive director, but just as an individual as well. We um, obviously, we all are still dealing with the aftermath of Hurricane Helene. Um, first of all, how are you doing? Doing good, okay. thank you. Okay, good. Um, how has how important is farming as far as because I know farming obviously is important right now, especially. Um, how is that important now after the aftermath of the hurricane to you? Uh, it's even more important uh, doing the relief efforts. Doing the relief efforts, we got in and was helping deliver fresh produce to the CSRA and beyond to our rural towns. And people depend and really desire fresh produce, especially when they know that it's locally grown and they can go visit the farm and know what, what's growing and where and who's growing it. And so even though our farms was impacted rather by flash flooding or debris, and we have to start over, um, we have a farming cooperative that's willing to step in and we all can get our farms back up and going uh, collectively. 
If people want to get involved with farming, like they want they take have an interest in farming, what advice could you give someone? I would say um, make sure your heart posture is there because mm -hmm. you must have a passion for it. Um, it's not a fly by night career. It's something that you really have to be invested in um, because like we see nature comes. And so you have to be prepared for when nature takes its course, but just as much as you take away from the ground, you have to make sure you give back. So make sure there's reciprocity when you're dealing with the ground and what you're growing and what you're also taking in. Awesome, thank you so much for that. Is there anything else that you want to add or that you want people to know about you or Black Farm Street? Um, sure, I would also like people to know that it's more than farming. Mm -hmm. We do care about the inner souls of people. So we do have um, mental health classes. We have workshop for our youth so they can know what it takes to farm and what that looks like. And so if you're interested in even that sector of our organization, please reach us, reach out and, and connect with us. And if people want to reach out to you, can you please give us that information one more time? Yes, you can go to blackfarmstreet.org or you can go to allthingslashandra.com. Awesome. Well, Chandra, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for sharing your knowledge and we appreciate all that you do. And it's important that people know that there are black farmers out there. So thank you yeah. so much for that. Thank you. All right, thank you. All right, everyone. I am Carlton T. Clay. This is Celebrate Black Excellence. Where we celebrate black excellence every day. Have a good one.